And finally tonight, when uh, Rosie was separated from her owner during a walk in Loughborough, she didn't hang around. She knew exactly where to go and get help, and she even waited patiently there to be collected. Our Midlands reporter Ellie Pitt takes up a real-life shaggy dog story. She's so calm you'd think she just walked into her own front room. But Rosie has actually just gone into Loughborough Police Station. The Border Collie had gone missing but made herself comfy here while she waited to be collected. Well, I thought she was so clever and I was pleased that she was uh, not too distressed and uh, she obviously felt comfortable in the police station. And she was so well behaved when she went in. She's always well behaved. <laughs> <laughs> so you're proud of her? Extremely proud of her, yes. Steve and Rosie were out for a walk when a firework went off, which scared her. The collie ran for cover and found the police station. Fiona Lacey was just finishing her shift when she saw Rosie in reception. I thought it was wonderful, it was really strange. Uh, like I say, it's, dogs don't just wander through. I've never seen a dog wander through into the front inquiry office, especially one that's been spooked by fireworks and it got lost and uh, brought itself to a place of safety. Very, very clever dog. Well, kisses. Thank you. And when that call came from the cops, the Harper yes. household was reunited once again. It was a big relief. We knew where she was, so I was grateful to the police and for a collar and a tag to let the police know uh, where to send her, not to Dog Borstal. <laughs> <laughs> Rosie is such a good dog, she handed herself in. Even if it's with a detour, she'll always find her way home. Here we are, Rose. Thank you. Ellie Pitt, ITV News, Loughborough. And that is all from us for now. Julie is here with the latest, in particular, the developing situation in Poland. But